the wildfire crisis out west once again exploding. We got fire heading our way. Flames tearing through this cabin as firefighters work night and day to keep the Caldor fire from overtaking South Lake Tahoe. One homeowner spray painting no insurance policy, please help, hoping to get the attention of firefighters. He says, I've heard that if you write that sign on your house and you really don't have insurance, and I don't, then they might, the firefighters might be more inclined to help you out. Near Echo Lodge, flames swarming the surrounding forest. ABC's Kana Whitworth on the ground explaining the difficult fight for fire crews. To give you an idea of the kind of terrain these firefighters are dealing with, you see that incredibly steep hillside there and all of those trees sort of clustered together on fire at the same time. So those fire damaged trees falling over is a huge concern for firefighters. Every containment line that we've had on that eastern side, it has skipped it. This is a, a very rapidly uh, driven fire through terrain. And it's, and it's the weather uh, that's helping to drive it. The threat sparking evacuations in nearby Nevada. We're waiting. I mean, it might be any hour now. Further north, the Dixie Fire continuing its path of devastation. Smoke and flames seen from a distance racing up the hillside. Aircraft scooping up more water to douse the out of control flames. Climate experts warn these fires will only get worse as we sink deeper into global warming. If we are successful with the uh, Climate mitigation, we could stop this negative trend uh, around 2060s. And some good news, firefighters were able to get some containment for the Caldor fire near Lake Tahoe. But still, there are red flag warnings in place as that fire continues to burn. Morgan Norwood, ABC News, Los Angeles.